This is Peter Rosenberger, and this is A Minute for Caregivers. From extended hospital stays surrounded by faceless people in masks to longer nights where loneliness and fear serve as companions, caregivers remain prone to feeling adrift and disconnected. Longing for recognizable landmarks that signal safe harbor, caregivers face the challenge of re-anchoring themselves, often in a storm. But it doesn't have to be complicated. During my wife's surgeries in Denver, I stepped into a Waffle House near the hospital. I love Waffle House. I grew up going to Waffle House, but now we live in Montana, and there's no Waffle House in the whole state. In Denver, where I knew few people, everything required learning and adjusting. But stepping into the local Waffle House, familiar sounds, sights, smells, and tastes flooded over me. For a few moments, I reconnected and felt at home. Grabbing a takeout order, I took it to the hospital to share the familiar with Gracie. While we can't always change the disorienting circumstances we find ourselves in, we can find new ways to connect to things that settle our hearts. Sometimes it's as simple as a waffle with pecans and chocolate chips for Gracie. Trace Atkins once stated, I have always loved Waffle House. It's been like an oasis in the desert many times late at night after one of my concerts. This is Peter Rosenberger, and this is an excerpt from my book, A Minute for Caregivers, When Every Day Feels Like Monday, available wherever books are sold. There's more at HopeForTheCaregiver.com.